another video from the wonderful Dr. Linda Joy Rose, also known as Dr. LJ. Thank you for being here. Oh, it's a pleasure. And uh, before we go any further, I want to recommend her book, Raw Fusion Living. It's awesome. She also has a recipe book that provides a lot of these recipes that, um, these recipes that we've done and other ones that I use also with my family and they're fantastic. Well, thank you very much. We're going to make a green smoothie. And this green smoothie is really kid friendly. Actually, if you're worried about kids not wanting to eat, drink green food, you can add a lot of blueberries to it, which will darken the green, or just put it in a sippy cup. Or what I used to do with kids is just tell them it was like a monster moo, you know, <laughs> like it's something that would give them special powers too. So why don't we begin? Awesome. We always begin with something green, and um, baby spinach is fantastic because you can't even taste it in the mix, although you do want to vary your greens, try different greens because they have different nutrients in them. But uh, baby spinach is fantastic, and we use about 40% of the green to about 60% of the fruit. Now, banana is fantastic because anytime you put a banana in there or a lint leaf, it's going to really get rid of that taste of the green. And that's what you want to do with kids as camouflage and also with husbands, too. And that's how I got my husband to start drinking green smoothies. I have actually frozen a banana, and that gives it that really nice smoothie texture that everybody loves. So um, a frozen banana is great, or if you just have fresh and you have it frozen. And I'm cutting an apple right now, just an apple. You want to cut an apple. Apples are fantastic. That whole apple a day keeps the doctor away. Uh, it's just great to put an apple anytime that you do a smoothie. I put an apple, no matter what flavor. And you can just use, I'm using this particular blend, but use anything that you have in your freezer, in your kitchen. You can use frozen. And these are frozen strawberries. So we're going to go ahead and get these strawberries in here too. And you always want to put in about two inches of water. That ensures that your greens get very well blended. And the better blended that your greens are, the faster they go into your bloodstream and they stop all that sugar from hitting your bloodstream. That's why conventional yeah. smoothies are really not good for your kids. They're not well food combined at all. You don't want to put anything like protein powder or milk, or especially not yogurt like you find in the fast food ones. It's very, actually, very, very good for kids and could lead to metabolic syndrome, which could be a precursor to diabetes too. And we're, we're hearing so much about that right now in this country. So, uh, all I have to do is get the cover for this, which I'm going to run over and open. Can you get that? That's what I'm here for. Okay. <laughs> Sometimes we forget things right before we go on camera. And I'm just going to blend it up. It's fantastic. Yes, exactly. You just tell the kids it's got chocolate in it too and they'll love it. All right, here you go. Let's see what you think of it. Mm, I it's love it. Not just kid friendly, but you're going to love it too. And the idea is get that in first thing every morning before your coffee. You want this to hit your bloodstream. You want this to be the first thing that's going to help alkalize your system and start you out with a fantastic day. This is really awesome. Thank Great. you. Thank, Thank you, Dr. Because this um, tastes a lot like the yogurt smoothies that you get, but it's there's no dairy in it whatsoever. All the stuff is very anti aging Fat free. Too. Yes. <laughs> yes. Awesome. Yeah. And I want everybody to know that she lives this lifestyle. She's 58 years old and she's smoking hot. <laughs> Thank we you. Can, we can look the same. <laughs> this is Rosemary with Motivating Other Moms and Dr. LJ of Raw Fusing Living. Thank you. Thank you.